Alright, so um, in the last part I showed you this um, style of thing and um, now that we've done that there's um, we'll move on to the next part. So um, log on screen is the next thing. You'll need a program called Log on Studio. It's from that Stardock um, dot com, um, but this is a free version. It's a free software. Um, it's not going to cost you any money for it. So let the page load because the internet's slow. download here and then um, you can choose whether you, um, you have the XP one or the Vista download I'm going to download XP but um, I've already got it installed actually so I don't need to do that but you just click on download and run it and I think you might need to restart your computer, but I'm not sure. Um, actually, I think I have to go to my program files. Just so I actually don't have it installed, so um, I'll download it. And I'll pause it while it's downloading. Um, yeah, you get taken to this um, download.com link. Click on download now. I oh, uh, can't be bothered waiting for it to download, but just click on download now, you install it, and then um, I'll show you the theme. Go to um, it's another DeviantArt link, and um, this is uh, just a little preview of it click download and um, again I'll have to pause it just to keep this video short right now you have a zip file downloaded um, just extract it to your desktop And um, actually, that wasn't that one. I'm not sure what you do with that, to be honest. Um, it was some different one that I downloaded. Um, oh yeah, the one that I use, um, the program that I used was Log On UI. I'm not sure, but if you download either of them and you search, um, let's say, Mac logon or logon UI, I think I know what time you do with this. You download this, okay. Um, extract it. Um, you probably want to create a new folder actually first. So, um, new folder. Let's call it Mac Log On. Drag the files to it. Okay. Um, you can delete that now. And then I think when you boot up um, Mac, when you boot up Log On Loader, um, you just load the theme.ini file into it. Um, yeah, 
I think you just um, put the ini file, load the ini file into the logon loader, and um, that should sort it out and give you a Mac theme sort of logon. The next thing is sounds. If you come to this link here, which I'll provide, um, you can download the Jaguar sounds for PC. So you just click on the download, you'll get a file with all different sounds. And what you do once you downloaded them is you have to come into your control panel, go to I think it's sounds and audio. Go to sounds here on um, sounds and audio devices, and then go to sounds tab. Um, and you can um, customize the sounds. So if you click on this one, you can click and browse for a file. So um, you can click on if you depending on where you put it, you could go into my music or whatever and or wherever you put it and um, download it and um, select it that way and um, but you have to do all the manually and you have to see which ones fit what it doesn't necessarily save for all of them and the extras for it um, you can want a dark. You can either use rocket dark, which is what I use. Um, you just go to the top here, click download, and you download this latest version here, and it'll come up as an exe. And you can just um, set it up, and then you can have it, and you can go and customize it however you want. Um, just right click on it, click dock settings, you can change everything in here on how it works and stuff. Um, and then if you, if you have downloaded Rocket Dock, you want a leopard skin for it, which is from this place here on DeviantArt. Just click download and Um, object dark actually. If you go to the DeviantArt homepage, um, categories, just so I can pause it while I find it. Right, here we go, I found, um, found another one. This is the leopard theme. Actually, um, instead of doing that, I will actually host my own theme that I have it because I can't actually find it at the moment. I'll just go and find it. Rock dark um, skins. Okay, here it is leopard. Um, I'm just gonna copy it. Copy it to the desktop here, and um, I'll add it to an archive for you, and I'll send you the link for it to finish it up. Um, so yeah, I'll just host this file for you, and um, I'll provide a link for it. 